shit! <laughs> DJ, hit one run. A drive. A drive and a half. Ah, John, where are we? It says we're in Tulsa. You want to take a guess where we're at? Tulsa, Tulsa. It says right there. Tulsa, Oklahoma, baby. No, yeah. I'm just kidding. Welcome back to another Guga Squad episode. This is where all the magic happens way up north. We took Route 1 to basically almost the border of New Brunswick, Canada to Maine. Quite the drive, we'll go bright and breezy this morning. But we're after some big fish today. And we got to get some fishing gear before we catch this. We got the boat. We've, of course, got, you know, some good Guga baits and some Guggen cranks and hard baits in the boat, but we want to get a little creative. Thinking maybe we'd stop off at this gas station and pick up some supplies in order to catch these very finicky fish. Do you have any ideas what we should get? Yeah, I was thinking we'd do something crazy and do a gas station challenge, but looking at this sign, they actually have some legit fishing supplies. So, try to catch so a bit like not like, like a, like what, like a Twinkie and then yeah, like exactly. a crankbait or something exactly. like that? Exactly, yeah, okay. Twinkie and crankbait. Okay. And we'll try it, and we'll see uh, who can win this challenge. Toast. I do this all the time. That way, first one to catch a fish on each lure. Yeah, let's do that. Mike's the challenge master, so. That sounds good. We kind of have yeah. a disadvantage, so so is Jack back <laughs> too. I'm, I'm, listen, I like throwing Ned, I like throwing rattling Ned, drag and drop, that's my thing. So I'm not used to catching fish on gas station paraphernalia. Anyway, let's head in there and uh, pick up our, our goods for today. This one, going old school. Meps, inline spinners, and Vienna sausage. Oh, I also have an energy drink too. That's for me though, not the fish. There's my duo. I'm gonna go ahead with the orange. I got oh, the nerds rope, nerds rope and the orange, Ooh. yeah. Do a little Carolina. Oh, right? dude, you know the deal, you know the deal. <laughs> I'm gonna spice things up a little bit. What is this thing? Oh, this is very light. Now I wanna go with the biggest bait they have in this section, which is right here. And actually, you know what? I think I know exactly what I wanna pick for my more unusual item. Let's go over here. A pair of nail clippers. I'll make something out of this. You see, every good challenge needs a bit of a punishment, especially when we're with the Guggens. And we didn't establish that we were gonna do this, but I just took it upon myself. I oh found a delectable gosh. little snack in the gas station. Maine, nor especially northern Maine gas stations, have just such interesting finds. We got some Hannah's pickled eggs. Oh, it's not leaking. Oh, it is leaking. Here, look it up. Oh, I can <laughs> smell it, dude. Oh, Ooh, yeah. So I think loser gets to suck one of these down. Don't even, you don't even get to chew it, just do you, remember, do you remember what happened this morning, what I had to do? Yeah, we had to pull over first two minutes to drive so he could poop in the woods. What do you, what do you, a deer? He said, John, stop right now. He's I'm a, not kidding. It's like that saying, does like a bear in the woods, but it's like, does Mike in the woods? And the answer is yes. Yes, yes Mike in the woods. Anyway, loser gets a snack on one of these. Ooh, hopefully oh. I don't lose. Oh. Damn. I'm throwing up, dude. Oh, that's good stuff. I'm throwing up. What? All right, guys, we made it out to the water. I'm unboxing my unusual fishing bait right here. I'm gonna turn this into a fishing lure. Look at the way the sun reflects off of these nail clippers. It could look just like a dying shad. I don't know if there's a shad in here, John. No, there's no shad, but I, can I interject real quick? Yeah. You know what I think about your choice of gas station lure? Yeah, sure. I think it's gonna result in you eating an egg. Oh, okay, <laughs> all right. Oh, well, yeah, I think differently, but uh, only time will tell. We're out of here. Challenge is about to begin. We're tweaking up our uh, our rods, making sure all of our gear is situated. I'm excited for this one because this kind of adds a twist to a normal day of bass fishing. Like, we have the opportunity to catch fish, potentially, on a freaking Vienna sausage. Mike's got uh, nail clippers over there. This is how this challenge is going to work. Three anglers, two baits, one of which is a gas station item, the other one is a fishing lure that we found at the gas station. The first one to catch fish on both is out. They're done, they're done fishing. So in theory, you just need to catch two fish, one on the gas station non-fishing item and one on the gas station fishing item. The loser of this challenge, the last person out of this one, is gonna have to suck down a pickled vinegar egg. Oh my God. You can smell it from here, man. Oh God, you can't. <laughs> this smells absolutely putrid. Oh, pickled in beet flavor and vinegar beat it oh that's why it's, i was wondering why it was like <laughs> pink yeah bro all right boys look at it look at look at the shot in there look at those eggs in there. there's no way anyone would want to eat those you gotta be how old is this how long have they been in there all i know guys is 
I cannot lose this challenge. I'm gonna be fishing 120%. We've actually have the spoon tied on. Six dollar spoon right here from the gas station. Look in the water, it actually looks beautiful. Just look at that, Ooh, that look at that, look at the good. flash. Perfect time that they'd be whipping out the spoon. You guys are in trouble. You boys are in trouble. Good luck. All right, three, two, one, go. No, I'm go. <laughs> no, I'm playing. Okay. Not yet. We're rigged and ready. You're on some Willy Wonka. That's what I'm saying, you know? Oh my God, dude, your ear. That's crazy. Oh, is it still? It's oh yeah. Just, yeah. If you guys haven't seen that episode, we just wrapped up another video here on the uh, on the river, and I let a crawfish pinch my ear, and I did not know that they could pinch that hard. I just noticed it too. I was yeah. out fishing when you were doing that. <laughs> yeah. or I was focused on fishing. I'm like, oh my god. All right, me. boys, should we start the challenge now? Let's do it. Is Mike ready? You ready? Wait. Wait. I think we're getting serious here, boys. Jack is coming off right here, guys. Check out the new merch coming out. Be sure to go to goonsquad.com, use your favorite creator's code, and every $5 spent is gonna get you one entry to winning a new Guggen truck. Don't miss out, get this amazing merch. You won't be disappointed. Thanks. There you go. Wow, I'm gonna have to cut that up a little bit maybe. Got my Vienna sausage right here. I only have six of them, so I'm gonna have to make this last. Cutting up my meat a little bit there. Put it back in the sauce, let it marinate. I'm just gonna kind of go with that Ned rig approach. Ooh, this is really, ooh, this is really soft. This might not work. I may have sabotaged. Why are you using the sausage first? Why don't you use the regular fishing lure first? The, I, don't think the sausage I may have sabotaged good. John, because when I saw him with those in his hand, I myself have done quite a few gas station slash food fishing challenges. You know all about and uh, yeah, I knew for a fact the Vienna sausages were not gonna stay on the hook. <laughs> I knew for a fact. <laughs> I thought they were gonna be like an actual hot dog. No, no, oh, it kind of looks good. I think uh, I think John's gonna be one eating that egg. That's what I think. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. I hope so, cause I am not trying to eat that dang thing. <laughs> Just say start. I'm ready. All right, start. Start. We're in there. All right, so the goal is try to find these fish. Spoon, great bait. Clear water, sunny conditions, got flash. I'm just gonna reel it slow and steady and it's a multi-species lure. Could catch anything. If, it, if you catch a muskie, you're automatically safe. Is that an instant dove if you catch a muskie? Can we say that, John? Oh, I bet. John, you know that's gonna fall right off. Now, I'm gonna give you a little hint, John. If it's falling off, you can use fishing line to tie it onto your hook. That's a little hint for you, buddy. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> I completely f***ed up by getting Vienna. So I, in my head, it's like a hot dog stays on the hook so well, but. Vienna sausages are not it. I, I was feeling pretty confident until now. Until like right about now. <laughs> I've already lost two. I'm feeling way more confident now, honestly. Oh, oh man. Jesus. Bro, we just found a ton of them. Yak pack just got bit. I lost my oh, third sausage. I got smashed. I got, oh, oh my god. Oh no my god. way. No come way. Back, come back. Come back. Come back. No way. Come back. Come on. No. Come on. I gotta land him. No. No, no, he came off. Off. no, 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 no. Let's no, no. go, baby. Come on. Woo. This school's getting activated, boys. Okay. This is our chance. Um, These boys are messing around. I'm in the juice right now. Once you get that first bite, all those fish get fired up. Oh, I got bit. I got bit again. I don't know what these are. I'm guessing they're smallies. I don't think they're very big, though. Oh! No I'm way. on! Big one! No big way. one! No we way. need the net! No way. We gotta land it. Yo, John, come land this for me. You're losing anyways, bud. Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot. It's big. It's big. We gotta land it. It's big. I mean, not PB, but it's freaking big, dude. I wish it, I honestly wish it was smaller. I'm getting a little cheese, little wee. Okay, I got no help here. You gotta keep the tension on. Oh, I ain't helping. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, don't lose it. Don't, don't. Come on. Come on. Don't lose him. Don't lose him. Ah, let's go. There's number oh. one, baby. Oh. Hey, that is why you boys want to fish a spoon for smallies right here, baby. Oh, yes. Hooked on the outside of the mouth. Look at that. He swiped at it. Probably tried to hit the old shiny part, but hey, he got hooked. That's all that counts. We've got one down. We need to catch one more on nail clippers, then I'll be safe. Beautiful fish. Mwah, thank you. I don't want to eat that egg. Whew, these fish smell good. Let's let her go. See ya. So let me show you guys what we're gonna do right now. We've got to make a bait out of these nail clippers right here. I'm actually gonna take this treble hook off of my spoon so that I'm, I no longer need it anymore. We're gonna create a nail clipper spoon. So I'm gonna take the treble off like this. We're actually gonna. No oh, he's on! Yak's on! No, no way, way, dude! No way! Hey, Ned's right, hey, Ned's next to your left foot. I ain't helping you, but Ned is right no there. No way, dude. Oh! <laughs> oh. Let's go! 
got the candy in his mouth. Oh gosh. Come oh, here. No. Get over here. Look at that. Look at that hook set. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm. First fish for me on the candy. Now, change it up. Get back in there. Now I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make a. Oh, John's on. Let's what? go on the sausage, baby. On the sausage. No way. On the sausage. It's a good one too. On the sausage. Y'all doubted me. Let's go, baby. Woo! I'm safe. I'm safe. I got the hard one out of the way. Oh my gosh. My heart is pounding. I just caught a freaking smallmouth bass on barbecue Vienna sausage. That is what's up, baby. That's what's up. Whew. All right. All right. Time to get retied. I need to get back in there. Holy hell. All right. Good smallmouth. My first one is tied up one to one to one. Okay. All right. Here's what we're doing, guys. Thread the nail clip. Oh, fudge. Oh, fudge. Oh, no. Oh no, look at there, look at there. We're just gonna thread, we're gonna do a line through spoon. Take our treble hook right here, tie it on. That's all she wrote. The fish are active, it's all about speed. We just gotta get our bait in there. If they'll eat sausages, if they'll eat nerd rope, I guarantee you they'll hit the shiny pair of nail clippers. Okay. Right there. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, I got bit! Holy sh, I got smashed. Come on, baby, come back for it. Come back for the nail clippers. One time for me. One time for, One time for daddy. Dude, this is getting intense. I mean, this is a tied up game right now. We're all, I mean, TJ and I are throwing actual lures, but the problem is these fish are so deep. I don't know if what we're throwing is, is necessarily the best move, but I also just caught a fish on the sausage. He caught one on nerd's rope, so <laughs> I don't think it really matters. We're on the fish. They're definitely down there. Mike is now throwing his gas station item. And uh, as much as I'd love to say he's at a disadvantage, I don't think he is. Oh, I got bit on there already, bro. Did you really? Yeah, you're done. I got a big hit. You just missed the hook. Here no, we go. Oh, no, there we go. Way. There we go. No way, John. Oh, go. Don't lose him, John. Don't lose him. Don't lose him. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Don't lose him. Come on, baby. Oh, he's on the lure. We're good, baby. Oh, oh my God. No gas station egg today. My heart's pounding, bro. I got a weak stomach, man. If I would've eaten that, you would've seen me throw up. I don't think y'all wanna see me throw up. There we have it. Vertically jigging an inline spinner in 47 degree water. I don't know what's more impressive, the inline spinner or the sausage. Now it's up to these boys, figure out who the loser is. Whoever catches the next fish is safe. No way, no way. Oh, TJ! No way, no way. I'm gonna put my back. I'm gonna put my back. Oh no! No, 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 no way! That doubled up! Someone's putting it, bring it in faster! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! No! No! Let's go! No freaking way! No way! There's no way that just happened! Let's go! Bro, it's because your fish was smaller! Bro, you had the heavier rod with the smaller fish and you got it in first! Bro, I'm Oh my! I just boat flipped that thing from 10 feet out of the water! Whose fish it was. I was like, who just won? There's no oh, way. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I cannot freaking believe that just happened. Victory was in the palm of my hand. And TJ hooked up and boat flipped from 10 feet out. Dude, we've done so many challenges. Beast, bro. I, we've done so many challenges on the Guggen Squad channel. This was most intense. They literally hooked up within seconds of each other. And you. <laughs> <laughs> I and didn't my, have time to tighten my drag. I just said, I grabbed the line like this and I just flipped him wow. from like 10 feet out. Dude, you're a beast. You yeah. deserve it, bro. Oh my God. Gosh, dude. on the nail. Look that at it. Look at this. Insane, look at this. Oh my my line through nail clipper spoon right there. I got a beautiful fish. This is a great fish, but it was too big. I couldn't boat flip it. I'm using an ultra light rod. TJ has a medium light rod. He had more hook setting power. <sighs> oh. My favorite most... fish catch ever, I swear. <laughs> I've never boat flipped a fish from 10 foot out. Like, and do you even know if that's your fish? You, how do you guys no, even it, know? No, it was his. No, it? Yeah, oh, okay. yeah, yeah. I just unhooked mine. Yeah. Okay, I got you. No, he was a beast. I mean, he, I, he, I thought I was good. I, I tried to boat flip, but I failed because my, I had an ultralight That rod. was the best, like, not only gas station challenge, but challenge I've, I've ever been a part of. That was so intense. <laughs> that, was in, that was nuts. That was crazy. <laughs> well, I'm going to throw mine back. You deserve to live for another day, buddy. You almost Ooh. got me second place, my friend. You're too big! Too big! We need you to be smaller. All right. If this fish was half the size, I would have got him in first. It was too big, too powerful. I couldn't, I couldn't, 
I couldn't get the dub. Damn it. Beautiful fish though, man. There she goes. Well guys, now I've got to accept, I accept my defeat. TJ beat me fair and square, so did John. It's a good challenge. And now we have to gobble down one of these. It's dripping. Why is it dripping? Pickled eggs. Let's go ahead and uh, let's, let's just get right into it. Let's get right into it. $16 for this. It's stuck. Uh, oh my gosh. Bro, I can't open this. I don't know if it's because of my thumb or what, but. Uh, TJ. No, I ain't touching that. It won't open! I, you're getting pickle juice all over your boat, bro! Oh, it smells so bad! God, my, my thumb, I can't use my thumb. I need help. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, is, is it hard or what? Am I right? Oh, bro, what the hell was that? There you go, now it's open. Oh, <laughs> shit! Bro, it's still There you go, get your eggs. Hey, pour some of that juice out so it don't spill over in the boat, you know? Yeah, I, I agree with that. Oh, bro, that is psychotic. Dude, it wasn't even sealed! The seal was broken! Oh, did I you break the seal? Oh, you broke the seal. <laughs> Well, the seal still wasn't sealed because it was spilling out. Why are they pink, bro? <laughs> I've seen, I've actually, I've actually had pickled eggs before, but I, I've actually had pickled eggs before, but never that are like pink. It's like Easter, bro. Like what the hell, man? Bro, I'm gonna need you to grab one out or something. I fuck. Here, here, here. here. I'll, I'll oh, you eat. can smell it from here, dude. Oh god. Yeah, yeah, grab one. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me help you. <laughs> Give me those scissors up there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you, John. I'll cut you a little hole. Yeah, thank you, bro. <laughs> All right. A little oh, gateway. This is, this is how much line I had out, John, when I boat flipped it. There's my lure right there. I just grabbed it right here and flipped it. Are you gonna? Okay, so right. here's here's my question, Mike. Yeah. Are you gonna swallow it or are you gonna chew it? I'm chewing it. No, I'm chewing it. You can't. How, how are you gonna swallow that? You kidding, right? I don't know. You got the. You're, you're a throat goat. I feel like. You can just... <laughs> throat baby. Oh my gosh. All right, let's grab one of these eggs out. God. Oh. Oh. What? Why is it this color? Dude, it's like Easter. Oh, shaking. <laughs> How did I lose? I had the fish on. Oh, I had it on. All right, here we go, guys. Guggen Squad gas station smallmouth fishing challenge. I am the loser. Oh, <laughs> 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 oh come on. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't need this. You didn't even need it. Bro! I can't eat it. <laughs> TJ, hit one run. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. Why are you throwing up, TJ? <laughs> that was literally... I'm never you eating eggs. Eat it. You eat I can't! How am I supposed to eat that? I chewed it as long as I could. Probably eat half. I eat half. Bro, I can... TJ, what do you think, bro? Don't do it again. Don't do it again. <laughs> Bro, you can't eat. You have no idea how these taste. It literally. I do. I've had. I've had pickled eggs. No, before. the seal is broken. I'm pretty sure these are rotten. No. Uh, bro, you, you want to eat one? I'll go eat one. I'll go eat one. Go eat one, then, buddy. I didn't lose. <laughs> Listen, I, had the whole I didn't thing. lose. I had it in my mouth as long as I. Bro, my could. gut hurt so bad because <laughs> once Mike started vomiting, <laughs> yak backs like also simultaneously. <laughs> It's just like it was like a chorus of gagging in the boat. I'm like, what is going on? I'm such a picky eater. There's no way I could have done that. No oh, way. That was top, top three. One of the most nasty foods I've ever eaten. In fact, all of my nastiest foods came on Googie Weeks. Yes. That one time I ate, I ate a, a fish out of a can during a podcast. One time when I lost the steak challenge. Oh, I need some water. I need, I need something to drink. There's beer. drink somewhere. Yeah. Oh god. Oh. Can we just sink those? Ugh. He's, he's washing his mouth with. <laughs> that helps. That helps. <laughs> That's how you know we're in Maine. Homies uh, wash his mouth with something. Okay. Oh. Well, I think that about does it for today's Guggen Squad episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out the new merch. GoogleSquad.com. Use your favorite creator's promo code. Be sure to subscribe for more videos. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.